Welcome back guys. I have not done a grocery haul in a couple weeks. We have had a crazy couple weeks with the kids being sick one after another. Um, I got a cold. Chase is teething like crazy and he got his first two teeth. So that was really fun. Lots of sleepless nights with that. Um, but I did a grocery run just now. I just um, set up all my groceries so I could show you guys what I have. Um, I put together a quick um, meal plan for this week. It's pretty easy. We need like an easy get it back together week. This is only a four day school week. So um, yesterday was Veterans Day um, and we were over at my mom and dad's house doing yard work. So I didn't have to worry about groceries yesterday, which was nice. Um, but I will show you my list. <clears throat> I will show you my meal plan. And before I jump into this, I have a question for you guys. So I'm trying to use up a bunch of the stuff that we have in our um, deep freezer that is downstairs. I have never had to defrost a deep freezer. We have like some ice buildup and I keep meaning to do it. Do you have any tips, tricks? Have you guys done it? Um, I obviously have heard that you like you put towels so that it doesn't leak all over your floor. Um, but any tips and tricks would be very much appreciated, so leave them in the comments below. So let me jump in, I'll show you the meal plan, and then I'll show you the groceries. All right, so this is my meal plan for this week. Um, like I said, yesterday was Veterans Day. So we were, we just did take out my mom and dad's. We were outside working all day doing leave pickup, so that was fun. Um, today we're gonna do shrimp for me and the kids. And then kielbasa for my husband. He does not like anything from the sea, um, unfortunately. So I have some kielbasa um, that I'm going to cook up for him. And then rice pilaf and broccoli. Uh, Wednesday, we're going to do roast Dijon chicken in the oven with potatoes and veggies. Just kind of like a one-pan meal. Um, you just put like chopped up potatoes. Um, I'm going to do peppers, possibly some more broccoli. Uh, and then you just put the chicken with some seasonings and some Dijon mustard. It's really easy, super delicious. Thursday, I'm doing barbecue cheesy bacon chicken. This is one of my kids' favorites with a salad. Friday, we're doing burgers and salad. Saturday, we're gonna do leftovers. And Sunday, we're gonna do turkey soup, um, possibly with like quesadillas. I didn't write it on there, but. Um, and then these two days might switch depending upon if we have enough leftovers, but that's an easy fix. This is my grocery list, which is a little bit crumpled now, but um, as you can see, I didn't need a ton. There's a couple things that I need to get at um, Walmart, which is bounce sheets and fabric softener. I don't get those at uh, Market Basket. But today, I spent $95.86, so I'll show you what I got. Here's the groceries all spread out, and <clears throat> over here, I have some green grapes. These actually looked really good. They haven't looked good lately. Um, some strawberries. I got a bunch of veggies. Um, and these are, yeah, these are three pears. I got some red bell peppers, um, some green bell peppers, some green leaf lettuce. I have a cucumber. I usually take these out of the bags, but I didn't have time, so we're going quick. Um, I decided to get Chase some yogurt. He's been doing really well with um, all his food and he's actually switched over to trying like um, very small cut up pieces of food and he's been doing good and keep meaning to get him yogurt so I finally remembered this is the banana and strawberry by Stonyfield um, and all my other kiddos eat this so got that got another pack of eggs um, if you guys watched my last video, you saw that I threw out my sponge and then realized I didn't have any more, so I definitely needed to get those today. Some soy sauce, just because we ran out. Um, some croutons. My kids love croutons, and me and my husband are fine with a salad without them, but if I put these on my kids' salad, they will eat it guaranteed. So for 99 cents, I'll do it. I got some um, sandwich rolls, these are for burgers. Some hot dog rolls, because um, my son doesn't eat cheeseburgers, so he is probably gonna have hot dogs. Um, these are, they're called the Works bagels, but they're um, everything bagels, they're really good. I got some ham, 
This is smoked Virginia ham for the kids' lunches. Um, I saw this and I thought this was really interesting. So this is cranberry sage turkey breast. So I just got half a pound, but that sounds really good for like sandwiches for lunch throughout the week. And then I got my husband some prosciutto. He likes to um, put together like little charcuterie boards sometimes. Um, we'll do like prosciutto, um, some crackers, grapes, and like cheese for like a little snack. So I just got him a little bit of that. These Sugardale uncured beef hot dogs, 2% uh, milk. I got some shrimp. I was actually going to get some haddock um, to bake for me and the kids tonight, but the line at the seafood counter was really long, and I didn't feel like waiting. So I got some frozen broccoli florets. My kids love broccoli, um, so we always have that on hand. I got these chicken patties. These are frozen. This is just for like a quick lunch, um, just to keep in the freezer. Some rice pilaf. We were out of pizzas because, like I said, the past two weeks have been um, a little rough. So there were some nights that we just needed something really easy. So I like to have a couple of these on hand just for those types of nights. This bacon was on sale. This is the Oscar Mayer hardwood smoked bacon. Only $2.99. So I got three of them, and I know I said I'm going to clean out my freezer, but I wanted to put a couple of these in the freezer, so um, these will fit up here, though. And then I got a bag of Mexican four cheese blend, and last but not least, toilet paper. So that is my grocery haul. So hopefully you guys enjoyed that little grocery haul. Maybe it gave you some meal inspiration. Just goes to show it does not need to be a fancy meal plan to just get you through the week. Um, I have a couple of really fun videos coming up. I have a dessert for Thanksgiving or actually any holiday. Um, it's a really delicious one, so stay tuned. That will be on the 19th. That's part of a collab. And I'm also going to be showing you guys my favorite side dish for Thanksgiving. So that will also be coming up soon. Stay tuned for those. If you guys are not subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you like this type of video, give it a thumbs up so I know to do more. So hopefully you guys are having a wonderful week and we will see you in the next one.